What's going on YouTube? Geosnow right here. A brand new proof of concept for a vulnerability that could possibly be useful for installing Troll Store has been released. This developer posted this, quote, drop a POC, which means proof of concept, for CVE 2023-41992 here. Few people have discussed this vulnerability publicly. iOS kernel vulnerability may have entered another era since iOS 16 and 17. And the write-up has been posted here on GitHub. You can find the entire write-up and also the proof of concept, which triggers the vulnerability itself and the entire code base is available over here so this is actually nice and while this is not directly useful for jailbreak purposes as michael puts it here this is definitely usable if exploited and that's a big if if somebody releases an exploit for it this could be useful to install troll store because this is actually part of the same chain that contained the troll store bug the core trust bug that we used for troll store on ios 16 and 17 and so on so they're part of the same chain and and they could be used together and you would be able to install troll store on ios including ios 16.7 rc and ios 17.0 with this bug now we don't know if an exploit will be published for this bug however the proof of concept for it the code that triggers the bug is actually available now and it was posted by this person over here anyway speaking of vulnerabilities in case you missed it there is now a new application created by myself available and you can download it today it works on ios 16.0 up to 18.3.2 and it's based on a different vulnerability released by EM Beer. And this one allows you to install some tweaks on your device without being jailbroken. You can hide the dock, hide the home bar, folder backgrounds, transparent music player, notifications, and so on. And you can even create your own tweaks. Check it out in case you missed it. Anyway, yes, this is not a major vulnerability release. It's just a local privilege escalation, but it's still useful in terms of troll store for those of you who happen to be on a proper iOS version for that. And if this gets exploited, we might see better ways to install Install Troll Store on iOS 17, maybe even without a computer. Anyway, that's basically it. This video was brought to you by Rayboot, a software that allows you to easily fix your iOS device if it's stuck in recovery mode, DFU mode, Apple logo, and so on. Definitely check the program out in the link below. A free trial is available for both Windows and Mac OS. You can also safely upgrade and downgrade to currently signed iOS versions using this tool. Check it out in the link below. And also check out my application in the link below as well. It's called iDevice Toolkit. And if you're running iOS 18.3.2 or lower, it works for you as well. So yeah, thank you for watching. I am Gio Snow. Till the next time, subscribe to stay updated. Peace out.